This video is sponsored by AppMaker. AppMaker is a WordPress plugin that converts WooCommerce website to mobile app. The mobile app builder helps you create native Android and iOS mobile application. Get an opportunity to grab 30% off by being the first 200 signups. Get the link in the description. Hello and hi, welcome back to Educate WordPress where we talk everything and all about WordPress. I'm Aisha and in this video, we're going to see how you can add custom product option for your products in your store. So now you can see I have a, a chocolate cake that I'm selling and I have to add some uh, custom uh, items that uh, I need to sell these products. Let's say uh, when you have a birthday cake, you want to ask what's the message that you want to read, uh, write on a cake or when is the delivery time or what's the thing that you want to add, etc. So for that, uh, I'm going to add these product options for this uh, particular uh, product. So I'm going to show you how this is done. For this, I'm going to go to uh, my dashboard and install a plugin. So in my plugin, I'm going to go to plugin and add new. So before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe as we come up with videos on WooCommerce and WordPress every now and then to get your website performance up and top. So the product I'm going to add is WooCommerce product add-ons, custom, pro custom product add-ons. So product add-ons for WooCommerce is the plugin that we are looking for and you can just install this plugin and you can already see that it has 30,000 plus active installation. So this is a great plugin and it has a cool drag and drop feature uh, that will help you adding the product form. So once activated, you can uh, go to the plugin section and see that WooCommerce custom product add-ons is activated. So right here, we're going to go to the create form option. So you can create form and this is the section that we are going to add this form. So I'm going to click on add new form and show you how this is done. So I'm just going to add a cake form. So if you have other gift or something or whatever message, uh, let's say if you are running a uh, gift option or uh, something like uh, something that you have uh, customizable options, you can add this form and you can see that you can add multiple fields like uh, text field, text area, uh, select option, check box, radio group, uh, date field, number, color picker, uh, paragraph, etc. Anything, anything you can add it uh, in here. Firstly, I'm going to add a text field. So I'm going to add the text field right here. So you can edit this. So uh, you can click on the required option if that's necessary. Uh, you can uh, write, uh, edit the text field as message and also placeholder. Uh, happy birthday. Like it will just show you what's, uh, what's the thing that's coming. Uh, etc so this is a uh, very very much optional so uh, you can just uh, leave this and if you want you can add a maximum length uh, for uh, words if this is a text field uh, this is a hundred uh, word or uh, limit so you can add that I've added the message right here so now we have to choose which is the product category that you want to to uh, show this uh, cake form on I mean, whichever form that's on. So I have the uh, product as cake. So all the categories that I have, I've uh, added this. So I'm going to update this. So yes, so that's done. So I'm going to show you how this is visible on my uh, page. So here you can see the message or you can write happy birthday, uh, whatever, whatever message that you have, you can just type it right there so that you will get the message. And whenever, uh, the, when you receive the order, you can see what, uh, what's the message that should be written in that. Also, uh, if you want, uh, something else like, uh, uh, some other requirement, you can also add another text field. Uh, for example, I'm going to write here, uh, special instructions you can add that as well again same uh, you can just uh, close this and also here i'm going to add another thing which is the uh, date field so when is the product that you want to uh, deliver it you can add that so you can edit this here uh, it's a delivery date So you can add that and also the value is obviously uh, date, uh, etc. And also if you want, uh, there are ma many other options like color picker, hidden input, as I said, you can um, make multiple choices using this area. So I'm going to update this. 
and show you how this is reflecting in my uh, product page so you can see there is a message and if there is a special instruction you can add that and uh, when a customer is choosing uh, a date uh, of their uh, uh, of their delivery uh, that person can choose that as well and you can just add that to cut so uh, let me write happy birthday xoxo and special instruction no x okay so uh, when i add this product into my cart you can just i'm just going to my cart and so i have placed my order so in the order details you can see the message the special instruction and also the delivery date so in the dashboard uh, of my uh, orders so you can see the woocommerce and orders here uh, when you receive the order this is the last order that i have and when i click on that you can see uh, the uh, status or uh, whichever the processing etc now here in the item uh, section you can see the message the instruction and also delivery date so uh, that's how you can uh, add the custom product add-ons into your website so that you can uh, you can sell these uh, multiple other uh, products for example if you are selling some uh, product that needs customization or that needs a delivery date or uh, if you are running a restaurant uh, there might be uh, instructions or something like that something on that line uh, you will need this plugin and this plugin will be very much helpful and i hope this video helped you if you like this video please give a big thumbs up and do subscribe and share the video we'll see you in another video bye